I want you to sit back and just think about what you're fixing to see. Of how many animals die every day in this country for nothing. All you read nowadays is in the news that our president and Congress is ready to push a button, get involved in world wars that really have nothing to concern us. Meanwhile, here in America, we have one of the worst wars of our own that's totally being ignored. That's starvation. The question is, is how come Congress and the president doesn't step up and do anything to stop children from going to the school hungry? Old people eating dog food and living under bridges because they can't afford to eat right here in America. Meanwhile, one city here in America throws away more good food than America could even use. The last question is, is how many animals have to die every day that don't even get used? Solely because Congress and our judges here in America allow people to be sued for no reason whatsoever. So I challenge President and Congress to do something about this. Instead of landfilling all of this food that we could feed America with, let's just stop polyvorous lawsuits and give away the food so the grocery stores can mark this down and people can afford to eat right here in America. Obama, Congress, this is a challenge for you to come up with a solution so America can eat without wasting all this and worrying about people getting sued. If I can figure this out from the middle of the country in Oklahoma, I'm sure sitting in your leather chairs up in Congress, you can come up with an answer to why America can eat. Can you afford to eat crab? I can't, but the landfill can. Let's stop this nonsense and feed America. Really, when you stop to think about it for real, how many animals just in our truck died for no reason? And this is only one city in one week. I bet you 500 million animals a year die for nothing. Meanwhile, we have little kids going to school hungry and going to bed hungry, but our landfills are completely full. Feed America for a change and let's stop worrying about other countries and let's take care of our own right here in America. I'm Joe Exotic and get used to my face because you'll be seeing it again.